Hello and welcome to a video of understanding what is a crypto wallet. In this video, you are going to understand the crypto wallets, what are public and private keys, and how do you use those wallets to do any crypto transaction. So let's get started. A crypto wallet is a software program, or it could be a physical device that allows you to store your crypto coins, your crypto tokens, as well as it allows you to have your crypto transactions processed. That means send or receive crypto tokens or currencies. A crypto wallet consists of two pair of keys, a private key and a public key. A wallet stores your cryptocurrency keys and allows you to access your crypto coins tokens and do those transactions. All of the wallets contain a public key, also known as the wallet address. You can share this public key with anybody else, doesn't matter. But what you need, and you don't wanna share this, is the private key to sign the cryptocurrency transaction, All right? So let's see the crypto, crypto wallet. As I said, a crypto wallet, you have crypto coins and tokens that can be deposited in the wallet. And then you can have the tokens coins exchange transacted for buying NFTs, crypto coins, or tokens. How do you get this crypto wallet? There are a lot of crypto wallet providers like MetaMask, which is very common, Coinbase wallet, Wenli, Portis, as well as Wallet Connect. You can use any of these wallets providers to have your wallet address, which is the public key generated, and the private key you need to keep it secret. Now, by the way, in one of the other videos, I'm going to show you how you can use Web3 to create your own wallet without the wallet providers directly on the Ethereum uh, etherscan.io. So let's get started. So first step is go to Google and search for MetaMask Wallet Chrome extension. And you would see MetaMask over here. And here, just click on Add to Chrome. It says Add Extension. And it's going to take some time. As soon as the MetaMask extension is done, it will show here on the bar, uh, on the on the toolbar, there you go. So the MetaMask extension is here. It says connecting you to Ethereum and the decentralized web. We are happy to see you. They get started. Help us improve MetaMask, just say I agree. No. Now there is a secret key option as well, wherein when you create a wallet, you can use secret key, which is a sequence of 12 words that you need to remember store in order to recover your wallet in future, if in case your Chrome dies or your, your, or your web browser dies. So click on create a wallet, enter a password, and then confirm the same password. Just make sure the password matches and say create. As soon as you say create, just say next. So, a secret recovery phrase is a 12 word phrase that is your master key to your wallets and funds. So just make sure that you, you save this somewhere and just say next. If I click this, you will see the 12 words that I have for my wallet and I'm not gonna do that. But when you are doing it, just click on this and you can download this and keep it in a very safe location. So well, now I'm gonna say remind me later. And they're done, right? You have an account. This is your public key, which is also the wallet address. And you can look at the account. This is your account. You can import another account if you have created somewhere else, or you can also connect a hardware wallet. By default, you are connected to the Ethereum mainnet. And you can see that 
you can also look at the test that will 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 uh, will show all will will discuss about all this later but now once you are done you would see the metamask wallet like this picture of a fox uh, on your web browser now let's see how you can connect and these are like test networks these are data enabled but for now you can right now you have zero usd obviously i did not send anything you can also import tokens or you can add a custom token for example if i want to uh, import um, matic right so i can import matic as well next and import token so you would see that matic is also available so you can you know do the thing over here and in the activity logs if you have any transaction it shows up next on the list is uh, how do i use this wallet so let's go so we go to uniswap click on launch app and you would see connect wallet here make sure the network is ethereum and connect wallet metamask it will ask you for approving this website to be able to connect it to your metamask say next and say connect done your you are connected to the ethereum network with, through an exchange app.uniswap.org you can do your transaction so very simple now you need to remember your private key and public key how you can get your private key is go to your account and here and go to account details and you can export by private key this is your public key share this with anybody else and you can also view this account on etherscan so this is an account it says nothing exists so metamask is an account provider the digital wallet provider for etherscan very simple i hope this was helpful and we will use this wallet in our future session thank you for watching